Okay, everybody, welcome back to Seven Days to Die Sorcery Mod. We are on day 56. It is not a horror night tonight, but it could possibly be tomorrow. Uh, we do have a quest, it's only a tier two. So we will likely. Where is that? Oh, it's right there. We will likely uh, go do that shortly. Uh, as soon as we go pick up this thing, the airdrop, it's not too far away. Or as soon as I get close to it, it's, the other one's going to light up too. Okay, stop before I run out, because you never can tell when you might need some for a zombie. Oh, hey, speaking of which. I love the charge speed on that. that jump, it was because I was running fast enough that I was worried about running over a landmine before I even saw it. So I was like, I'll just jump over the, some of the ruin area. Makes sense. Dropping off some stuff here, we will go... Those, were, those go into the materials box here. Okay, let's go do a, a quest. It's only two and a half kilometers away. It's clear the area, and it's only tier two. Okay, we got a tier two clear. Um, don't think I've been in this one before. This one's gonna be fun. Uh, actually, I think I have been in this one. Yes, I. I remember it now. That's a fake floor. Uh huh. Uh huh. And then the last time it got me anyway. Because it went fake floor. I'm like, oh yeah, haha, I fooled you. And I walked that way, and that one's a fake floor too. Like, uh, I guess I didn't fool you. I fell in anyway. Uh, what's with the dirt there, though? The dirt shouldn't be there. Huh. Okay. Yeah, see... We gotta... That dirt shouldn't be there. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> Shit, she got away. Question is, where is she going? Has she figured out where she's going yet? She's still below me. She okay, she's up on my floor now. It sounds to me like she's kinda of go out the back door. Oh. And hey, there she is. There she there her leg goes. Okay, that works. Where are you going, lady? No, what the hell are you doing? Really? 
Oh no, nice try. She's trying to fool me and let her hit me. Uh -uh. Whoa! Okay, you. What the hell? How are you walking through the past me while you're frozen? Okay, you need to die. But I need to die. You're crawling, so I don't care. Oh, she did not want to die. Yeah. Hmm. What's weird is he was running. But it's not nighttime, so he had to have come from the POI. Oh, I don't have another marker, so apparently I woke up the bastard, the other guy that was downstairs with her. The guy that was right there. Okay. Yeah, see, that shouldn't. Ah, it's bugged. That ah, shouldn't be that way. Really? Really, really? Okay, so we're gonna start with him. I wonder how the hell it woke him up. Wow, how did it wake him up? Why did he wake up? It's okay, everything's... it's still good, but... What woke him up? Why are they all waking up like this? Huh. I mean, I do not have from the shadows. And it is nighttime. And it is nighttime on what would normally... Be a horde night. There's a fire zombie wandering around. Who's not part of the POI. Which means I'm probably gonna get a fire zombie surprise. While I'm looking at one zombie, he's gonna walk up and smack me in the back of the head. I just know it. Alright, he... I was right. He tried. Wow, another leg gone. I was so right. You saw that. There's another one. The original radiated that ran up the stairs here. Beat her way out of the beat his way out of the building. Right there it looks like. Now we gotta find this fire zombie before it causes a problem. Okay. It's a little unnerving that when I got out here, it stopped making noise. We're gonna channel. Which makes it hard to see. There he is. Dog. It just ran through channeled ice to smack me. Bull. Shit. 
I saw the dog. I was channeling ice because I saw the dog. You guys gonna do the same thing? Yep, you tried. Ran all the way up to me. What through channeled ice. Look at that! I'm still channeling the ice, you can see it! Oh, oh shit. Uh, yep. Wow. One more. I see you. Haha, I hit you too. Wow, that was a big pack of dogs. Question is, did I get them all? Wow, a lot of fire zombies over here, too. Oh, nighttime. Sorry, guys. Just realized as soon as I put away my spell cast. Okay, you guys like the uh, gamma in the 60s? Like 65 seems to be a preferred rating, right? So you guys can see. Yeah. If it's too high or too low, let me know. So I can pay more attention to exactly what number I'm setting it at. I think 65 is what I've been setting it at for you guys. back inside. inside that room it looks like. Yes, unfortunately that room, that door will block that spell, so I'm gonna try to without waking her preferably. Yes it worked, okay. This even though the door is right next to her, the sound comes from me. So if I'm standing as far away from the door as I can when I hit it. Uh, there's a chance she won't hear it. Right next to her. Yeah, okay, let's make sure we don't hear any other zombies. Yeah, we don't hear anything. And the light keeps changing, so I'm guessing this is a cross, cross, uh, cross biome building, which is causing the light to change as I enter different biomes. Okay, well she's dead. <laughs> See, that's where uh, the trap. Okay, let's make sure this room back here doesn't have any zombies in it. Because I've had to get all the way upstairs, all the way in, it goes, Missed one! It does, haha. Uh -huh. Good thing I stopped and came back and looked. Okay, looks like we got two in there. And that's the way we're supposed to go. Is this door locked? No. Okay. So we're gonna go in here first. Okay, that's could be a problem. 
We're gonna sit back here. Actually, we're gonna go one step further. Let's sit back here. Can I break that without? Yes, I can. Cool. So we don't have a real problem. He doesn't know where I'm at. What do you guys think? Okay, he beat his way outside and in back into the hallway. Okay. Okay, so... That's the right way, so we're going to check in here first. Whoa. There's two in there. Since we can't see what kind of zombie that is. Um, there we go. Um, apparently we can't hit him. Okay, fine. I'm gonna get a little closer. Grab the steel shovel and some stuff. Okay. Shotgun Messiah crate. Okay. We shall take that. Ammo for our turret. Okay. This area is clear. Moving on to the right way, the right direction we're supposed to go. Okay, and again, two zombies in the closet. We're gonna back here, see if we can get there without waking them up. We did. And of course, I lose that spell. I expect to lose a couple spells. There's only two tier two POI, so I didn't bring a massive amount of, sp of ice spikes. But I did bring a decent stack, so we should be fine. If I'm going into a tier 3 or up, I'd probably bring at least four stacks just to make sure I don't run out. I even came up this side so that I wouldn't wake him up to avoid the paper, but apparently I still woke him up. And there's another fire zombie beating outside beating his way in. Okay. I'm gonna take out the radiated first just because they have a bad habit of waking up when they shouldn't. Okay. Another leg gone, so I made that a little easier. Okay, we'll take out this cheerleader first. Okay, I got my spells back from. Oh, he was, he was feral. Didn't realize he was feral the first time. Of course, I didn't realize he was feral because he was slowed. 
for mice. And my quest is done. Okay. Let's check the loot. See if we got anything good. Paper, no. No. No, I should have scrapped that. Another fire essence spoon, a compound bow. Whoops, I accidentally scrapped the fire essence spoon. <laughs> Not that I need it, I guess I should have probably been okay with scrapping it, but. Does this quest turn in to the trader that's by my base? I think it does. It does indeed. Hmm. I want to say... Oh, did I check that box? I don't think I did. Oh. Nothing impressive in it. Okay, so let's. Where is the garage? See, the garage is out back that that way. No, that way. So we're gonna go check the garage. Just in case that zombie decides it wants to try to get up here while I'm messing around. Even though I'm about to go down anyway. Oh, look, he's already got two ices, or all three elements around him. And he's dead. the one making all that racket. Is he actually inside? I think he is. It's not the one over there, is it? No, oh, he's too far away. And he's just walking around. He's not doing anything. Okay, we're heading in here. We got nothing in the roof this time. Hmm. Huh, interesting. Uh, yeah, I was about to say, I must assume that's all, that was unlocked and I could have just walked in. <laughs> yep, it was. It was indeed. Okay, so we we'll more frames. Some glue, and yes, I called that dirty water glue, because that's about all you use dirty water for. Of course, I'll turn the gamma back down about 5 a.m. because even daybreak doesn't, doesn't mean the sun comes out. It's, doesn't mean, well, it doesn't burn by it. Great. Now I hear you close. Are you actually close to coming out here? Uh, oh, he's right there. Right 
Great spellcast equipped if you're trying to make a high jump. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, let's go visit the trader. Turn in the quest. Okay, that was. Uh, I guess I ran in talk to him too fast. I yep, there sure goes. doubted it, but you pulled it off. Okay, we're gonna take the shotgun, I guess. What jobs do you have now? Tier four, clear. Two point three. I have a job for you. Waterworks. We, we will accept the waterworks. It has been a while we since I've been in a waterworks. Deal. Okay, we are going to sell the shotgun at discount, of course. And we don't have any money in it yet. Okay, that's fine. Uh, rent takes another 2500 so. Shotgun shells go over here. Okay, how the spellcast doing on something built in? That one needs to be. We only have 11 war ones anyway. Okay, so we'll put them in there. Uh, how are you doing? Twos and ones is what I was looking in. Do we have any twos and ones to put in? We have some more war. Okay. Okay, what was I melting in over here? We had ones and threes. Okay, we do have threes, we do have ones. Okay, let's turn this back off so we can play with it. Eventually, anyway, just because so, and we will. Oops, helps if I actually type that in right. Not that you can see it because what the hell? That is not what I typed at all. Hey, look at that! One thousand cement coming up. Okay. Set my timer so I don't know how long ago I took my last break. That's not good. We have, ooh, we have four points to play with. Oh, let's see here. Uh, do we max out the lightning spellcast? We max out lightning nova. Storm, and it's very all. Oh. Or do we max out Meteor? Oh man. Kind of want to max out Nova so I can have fun with a, a, a Horde Knight just screwing with Nova. Looks like we're playing with Nova. No, tonight. It looks like. Haha. <laughs> thing about Nova is you don't get them back. 
so yeah. When I say you don't get them back, what I mean is the fact that you can't pick up the Nova Snow. Like, once you cast it, it's gone. But tonight is a Horde Night. some fun with that. I was kind of hoping for another screamer, but since we're not getting one at the moment, maybe we will work on base a little bit. We have 270... F so we'll grab some reinforced concrete. Oh. Oof. We can make some more rebar, I guess. And yes, I put way more in there than was needed. That's fine. We're actually just going to turn that one off. We'll worry about it once we actually get some stuff to melt into it. Okay. Yeah, I thought so. They're, they're digging holes and shit in my stuff. Little bastards. Should be okay to do some work here. We will see a screamer probably. And eventually I will build out this way as well and this will be actually like a parking area where I'll par be able to park my truck and not uh, not have to worry about it vanishing, which is, um, th that bug's mostly been squashed, you don't see that bug much anymore, but and I still like to park on, on something, so just for good measure. Anyway, we got another screamer. So we're gonna just nuke the screamer, not even gonna farm it, just nuke it. And then we are going to call this episode here, and we will catch the next episode. Will be Horde Night 57. Blood Moon 57. This will be my, I want to say, yes, 10th Blood Moon. Um, I do have random Blood Moons, so. And I will catch you on the next one. And. I shall, and until then, see you later, and have a good one.